new Mercedes E-Class Coupe set for 2017 launch. Mercedes sleek midsize coupe features S-Class inspired looks, with deliveries set for April next year. Mercedes has announced full details of its all-new Mercedes E-Class Coupe, ahead of it arriving in showrooms in April 2017. The new BMW 6 Series rival will come with both petrol and diesel engines from launch. As we saw from the leaked images yesterday, the E-Class Coupe's design is heavily inspired by its smaller C-Class and larger S-Class siblings. The rear end, in particular, has familiar stretched tail lamps and the same rakish roofline, while everything from the A-pillar back is bespoke to the two-door. Naturally, pillarless doors and LED lights all round complete the upmarket appearance. The E-Class Coupe is 123mm longer and 74mm wider than its predecessor, although despite the roofline it's also 32mm higher. The wheelbase is also extended by 113mm, which Mercedes claims improves leg, head, and shoulder space significantly. For example, there's 74mm of additional rear legroom on offer, which should impress your passengers. The E-Class Coupe's interior, as we expected, echoes the saloons, with two optional high-res 12.3-inch screens that create a floating widescreen instrument and infotainment display. AMG line models, as well as offering bigger wheels and a body kit, brings along sportier cabin details and a revised leather-wrapped wheel. The coupe also carries over the same raft of connected services and autonomous safety systems you'll find in the saloon. At market launch, the E-Class Coupe will be available with one diesel and three petrol variants a different strategy to the saloon. The sole oil burner for now is the E220D, with the familiar 2.0-liter four-cylinder unit producing 191 bhp and 400 nm of torque. It manages 0 to 62 miles per hour in 7.4 seconds and goes on to a top speed of 150 miles per hour. Combined fuel economy is claimed at 71 mpg, while it emits 106 g slash km of CO2. The entry-level engine is the 2.0-liter four-cylinder E200, however that isn't being offered in the UK for now. A more powerful version of the same engine, dubbed E300 will be available to buy here. It produces 240 bhp and 370 nm of torque, Goes goes from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 6.4 seconds and tops out at 155 miles per hour. Mercedes claims 44 mpg combined and CO2 emissions of 147 g slash km. For now, the flagship variant is the E4004 MATIC. With a 3.0 liter V6 producing 328 bhp and 480 nm of torque, plus four wheel drive, it fires from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 5.3 seconds, and is limited to 155 miles per hour. Claimed consumption is 35 mpg and CO2 is measured at 183 g slash km. An AMG Lite E43 should soon follow with 396 bhp, while it won't be too long before a full fat 604 bhp V8 is dropped in to create the E63 AMG Coupe. All models come with Merck's 9-speed automatic gearbox as standard. The suspension has been revised over the saloons, too, with the standard springs sitting 15mm lower and with a comfort-oriented tuning. The optional 3-mode dynamic body control suspension is also lower, while air body control air suspension is also available. All E-Class coupes feature a wider track, 67mm at the front, 68 millimeters at the rear, which is aimed at improving handling for the two-door. The new E-Class Coupe will be available to order from the end of 2016, with first deliveries penned for April. No pricing details have been announced yet, but we're expecting a small increase over the equivalent saloon variant.